this little girl thinks she's going to go somewhere this morning, and it's so sad, sad day because she's not going to. Um, um, bye -bye. Not today. These guys are hard at work over here. Can Dad, Dad, can Sam, and Pat, Sam. Are you gonna hide in the cupboard? I spent my pantry day yesterday getting all my cleaning stuff ready. I made a big checklist yesterday of things to clean the house, and I'm hoping, well, I'm hoping to get this into a routine. Um, obviously, the kids still do their chores and all that, but there's stuff that just needs mom attention so I'm hoping to make that into a routine I'm guessing it's gonna take me about three days to get through it all this time but hopefully eventually we get down to like half a day like once a month so you okay it's okay <laughs> anyways we'll see how it goes but first this morning I've got to run to the store because our sink drain is clogged and Tom didn't have time to fix it so I'm gonna go see if I can get some drain cleaner and just do it myself and we have good news possibly the kids don't even know this yet but i had a message from amy this morning that said that they think the baby's coming soon so they're up in buffalo in a hotel waiting for labor to really take off so but guess whose birthday it is today Hi. Yeah, today's Aubrey's birthday. <laughs> so it's my sister's oldest child's birthday today. So if she has her new baby today, they'll share a birthday, which is kind of fun. Yeah, they thought maybe yesterday, but the doctor said she was. He didn't want her to go home, but it wasn't quite time yet. So the hospital is. This is where we had. Let's see. Asher, Judah, Justice, and Claudia were all born at the same hospital where my sister's at. And from our house, it's a hundred miles away. Um, from Amy's house, it's about a hundred and I had to change my battery there. Anyways, so Amy's family is just staying at a hotel close to the hospital and um, hanging out, waiting for labor to really take off. I don't understand. Does it? So we learn that ostriches like to eat turtles sometimes. Did you hear that bell ring? Okay, what we're going to do is everyone's going to take their sheets and blankets and pillowcases and put them down by the washing machine so that I can wash everything, okay? I need all the sheets and pillowcases and blankets down by the washing machine. Um, Asher, would you get the guest bed yeah. sheets and everything too? Somebody tell Thomas. Justice, why don't you tell Thomas? Okay. <laughs> yeah. So this morning I just finished editing a video that I had started like two days ago, but I hadn't worked on it for all day yesterday. So I hurried up and got that done this morning and I'll show you how far I got on my cleaning list yesterday. I got that far out of that much to do and I also am working on this second list and um, it took me well since I was actually keeping track of my time so I'd know how long this stuff takes me it took four solid hours of cleaning yesterday to get that far and it looks way worse in our house right now than it did before because as I'm like actually washing walls and doing that kind of stuff I've been hauling everything out of the room. Um, I've been hauling stuff out of the rooms that I don't want to keep in there and putting it on the dining table there so um, I can either put it where it belongs or get rid of it or whatever but I've just been like not wasting time making those decisions while I'm cleaning so now our table is completely covered with stuff and we have laundry that I folded last night that's still sitting around that needs to be put away but I have all the new shirts that I need to mark and do my video so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get Solomon started on school here this morning and then um, mark all those shirts lay them out on my bed do the um, shoot that part of the video so that the kids can put away their laundry and because it seems silly to have them go hang up all their old shirts and then turn around and take them off the hangers later today and put the new shirts on. 
So, um, yes, and I have a few paperwork things I need to get done today, and then we're going to keep working on this list. So I'm estimating that I'm still not going to make it through the green section of my list today, um, but we'll see. So hopefully, hopefully by the end of tomorrow, which is Saturday, I will have gotten through the whole thing, <laughs> but we'll see. And the, my homemade, um, fabric deodorizer spray were really good. I'm really happy with that. So, um, I'm, I'm excited to see how those, I hadn't tried it before, so I'm happy to see that they're actually, um, working the way they're supposed to work. And I will mention that I have not heard anything from my sister since yesterday, um, earlier in the day. So apparently there's no baby yet. So we're still waiting. So Judah found like the one clear spot. <laughs> oh, and Asher's hiding over there. He found himself a spot. I've been working over here on the couch. Yeah. Things always get better or worse before they get better. Some stars on the box. That's neat. I think Mrs. Mr. and Mrs. Reeves visited um, some of those cliff houses. Uh, they might be able to show you some pictures. That'd be neat, huh? Yeah. Mom, I shot that right. I can't go up there. And they got stuck. <laughs> I pushed them last, but they're not very good. Mom. It looks good. Mom, no one looks good. Good. Yeah, I had to go to the store so Solomon or Judah was helping Solomon and Solomon wants Judah to continue being his supervisor. So Judah's putting a star by his favorite word that Solomon wrote. What's mine now? There, I put one right there. Now I'm going to do on my favorite. No, no one look. I went and bought some nail polish remover because I was reading that you can take paint off of plastic with nail polish remover and I wanted to make this bucket not have Halloween stuff on it so that we could keep it for Justice's Easter bucket also. So it's taking a little more elbow grease <laughs> than I would like to do, but I got all that candy up right there and I'm working on these words here. I didn't get light blue because you guys didn't need new light blues yet. Are you excited to have some new shirts? Okay, finished. Did you write your verse on both pages? It's Friday, so Tom and Thomas are gone, and Asher's learning to run the office. And he's got a customer down there I'm looking at the security camera. Look at him being a man, taking care of business. He has unplanned the dollhouse stuff. Well, I think we're going to keep playing. I see. Were you watching Minecraft videos? Yeah. They've been in here playing with the dollhouse. Yeah. You know, Miss Claudia's taking a nap. Yeah. We keep making videos and then we watch them when we're done. And we take videos of our dreams and it's funny. This is taking longer than I thought. This just took me one hour to clean that trim, this wall, and the TV credenza and underneath of the TV credenza and that's my second bucket of water. This is going to take me a long, long time. So first before we started I went to
snowing? born at home. Thomas was born at a different hospital that was about 60 miles off from our house in the opposite direction from this one. But they stopped delivering babies when I was pregnant with Asher and so we had to find a new hospital and that's how we end up here because my aunt works for the doctor here or one of my aunts does. I have lots of aunts but anyways she really liked her doctor that she worked for and recommended him so we started coming to this hospital and then Amy started coming here too. So we had our next three babies here. Then we had two babies at home with a midwife. Then we had Sophia at home unassisted and then Claudia was born back at this hospital. Well, if you watched my birth video about Claudia, you'll know how that whole situation came about. But our plan is to stay home again with this baby. And today, I don't think I'm gonna get any video of the baby while we're in the hospital because my sister was not feeling up to being on camera but if we can get a still picture maybe we'll get a picture of the baby at least so we'll just see how it goes you got one of his toes broken no my toes are broken your toes are broken 
My toes aren't broken. Oh, they're not broken? Well, that's good. Why is she at the doctor? Because this is where her baby was born yesterday. Why do you have to go to the doctor with Amy? Well, we're just going to go visit her. Yeah, is she only going? Uh, no, Tristan is here and Aubrey is here, I think, and Camden and Hadley. He didn't think she's He didn't think she's her best friend. You but didn't think she's Hadley's best friend? Hadley's best friend. Um, her family has to be. Her family has to be her best friend. Yep. Because families are supposed to be best friends. Yeah, I think you're right. There's Amy's car. Yeah, do you see it right there? Is it black on it? No, this one over here. This one? That one right there. See it? Right there. That's the Amy's one? car. No, this gray one right here. That gray one? Yeah. That one? Yep. <gasps> is that her car? That is her car. Looks like her back of her car. Dirty. Yeah, it is dirty because they have to drive on lots of dirt roads. Okay. That sign says Johnson County Health Care Center. Okay, we gotta go down the ramp. Dad, can I do it? Yep. If you uh, watched Asher's birth video, there's the emergency door we went in when he was born. Look nice. Yeah. Good job. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Let's see if the, oh good the gift shop is open. We can see if we can get something for them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's locked. It says it's open, but it must not be. You want to ride on that? I don't think that's for people to ride in. It's just to look at. Oh, it's the light out. Oh, it was very fun getting to hold that new little baby. We were there for about three hours. A good long visit. Got to hold the baby well as long as Amy would let us. <laughs> she started getting a little anxious to get him back in her arms after a little bit, but it was pretty sweet and makes me excited that we're gonna have a new baby at our house one of these days. Mom, I'm high up. We are high up, aren't we? Yeah. Now where are we going? We're gonna go get some supper and head home. I don't know. We'll see what they have. Did you see that? We can see the mountain now and it's so snowy. Do you see it? Yeah, I see it. We're going to. We're going to get our supper. Um, when I was little, most of my childhood, my grandpa Kenny and grandma Fern lived here in Buffalo and they had a big log house at the foot of the mountains there and had a little creek running through the yard and we would go fishing and inner tubing and it was always Mom, a special place here. And um, I always just, I have fond feelings about this town and my babies being born here and all my childhood memories here. And, and it's such a pretty place too. It's just such a nice, nice place here in Buffalo, Wyoming. 
we're just here at Taco John's and I was so excited to have an apple grande because I haven't had one of those in years, but they're out. That's a bummer. So I'm going to get some tacos though and Miss um, Sophia, we're going to drive through McDonald's and get her a happy meal. <laughs> is your hair getting crazy? <laughs> hey, you guys. We can fix it. I'm not, I'm just looking at you. All right, well, I just finished scoring some tests and Mr. Solomon got 100% on his word building. I just finished my flashcards. Good. Look at how high up you're getting. So we have some kids this morning that are so worn out after our busy weekend. There and over there. And there's Asher who's just normal. And then there's some kids who seem like they have extra energy this morning. Like that one. And that one. Okay, so he made some ladybugs for the lizard. Yep, three um, sizes. Now he will not be hungry, will he? Mail. Get mail. This one. No, this one. You already read mail. Oh, I'm sorry. I skipped one. Nail. Yeah, nail. Okay, next one. Very good. This is like Taco Bell. <laughs> Taco Bell. <laughs> Only it's ball, like a bouncy ball. Okay, next one. How about this one? Bell. That one's like Taco Bell. <laughs> Taco Bell again. Okay, the next one. Duh. No, it's a duh. Sled. Oh, light. Light. Very good. Light. Weird. Asher's uh, sharing his gummy snakes with Mr. Solly this morning. And apparently with his mom. <laughs> <laughs> Miss Eden and I spent some time this morning practicing time and she's feeling much more confident now. Doing pretty good, huh? And I figured out that I was 10 minutes to lunch because I looked on there after I looked on there. Yep. And I'm working on cutting out all these flashcards. Judah's downstairs taking a nap. He wasn't feeling too good. Not physically ill, but just grumpy. I think he's got some hormonal changes going on right now and we both thought he would do better if he went and took a nap before we finished working on his schoolwork. And Solly was the first one done today and Asher's done. Solomon's making himself some peanut butter crackers over there. I might be the third one done. I don't know. You're gonna have to hustle. Get peanut butter on my fingers and I wipe it with the 
twice. That's a much better plan than using your shirt, pal. The crackers. You use almost all the crackers. That is a almost lot. Almost. Almost. Can you show almost. everyone your shirt? This is was his plan originally for <laughs> cleaning his fingers. <laughs> Judah and I are going to sit out here and eat our lunch together and use our nice new chairs. It is so nice out here. Yeah, it's like 70 degrees out today. Asher, stop chasing over that. You. You're gonna eat out here too? Why are you eating out here? Because it's so nice. You feeling better? Yeah. Good. Yep, you're growing. What were you guys doing over there? You and Justice? Yeah. What were you doing? We were playing snowball when he likes vines. He likes vines? Did he like to chew them up? Yeah. He's so cute, isn't he? Yep. And that's what he likes green grass. He does, doesn't he? Yeah. It's so beautiful, isn't it? Yeah. Yesterday it was freezing cold. Yeah, now it's just so nice, so we definitely want to be outside. Grandma Kitty said that um that this place is hotter because there's not as much trees. She said that the more trees there are, the hot the colder it is, I think. I don't know why. I don't know. Mom. Maybe the trees make cold stuff. Something. Mom! What? I know what you hear from my Well, he said I can come to a house tomorrow. She did. That's what she said. Tomorrow I'm gonna go to our team. These are comfy. They are very comfy, aren't they? We yes. got these for the porch, and I yeah. can't really see it, but I spray painted the legs like a copper color before we put them together. Oh, it looks like your bed. Yeah. Looks like my bed? Yeah. My old bed? Yeah, yeah it does kind of, doesn't it? I'm working on a little sample for the craft that we're going to make later this afternoon while they all play in this beautiful sunshine. I'm seeing this working on some schoolwork. These aren't the same length or what I'm making them about the same size like this. I'm not making them too thin. Just do one at a time. I did a whole bunch of them. Um, what do I do now? Okay, just a second. I'll show you. Oh, oh look at that. She's doing done. a good job. What do you think? You yeah. like your pumpkin? Yeah. We're going to hang it up so that it can be our decoration, okay? People will see it. That's fine. Here, bring yours over here and I'll help you with it. So Eden and Justice got theirs all done and they look so cute. Do you want to put mine? On. Yeah, you can put your leaves on so next. Cute. Yes, yours looks so, so cute. Yay. Solomon's pretty bitter about his, so oh. he's working on it. Oh, he on this little part. I don't. So. Yeah, not, I don't it's not like how real pumpkins are because there's holes in it. Look, you done it. 
tiny video. Oh yeah, I forgot to give this mm. back. Do you look at mine? Yeah, it looks super cute. You're super cute. They turned out good, didn't they? Yeah, I'm the half pump. <laughs> Eden's, no one's mine, and that's Sophia's. And Solomon didn't want his hanging up, so it's sitting over there on the shelf. Yeah. I said to Claudia, are you an ASL? She said, no, I came back to the Claudia, are you an ASL? Well, good thing Grandma's got three bathrooms at this house. Four bathrooms, actually. <laughs> no, she's got four bathrooms here. Four bathrooms with one person. Well, <laughs> one for ten people. <laughs> she's got one downstairs, and the one we always use, and then she's got one in her bedroom, and then one in the bedroom that we sleep in when we stay the night here. How many bathrooms Grandma has at this house? She only had two. I thought you were No, we're not sleeping here today. That's fine. What? Yep, it's still going. It didn't ding at 8.15 though, did it? Or did it? Did it ding when it turned 8.15? I wasn't paying attention, so we'll have to see. So we got Grandma Fern's clock all fixed up because it wasn't working right since the time change. And we fixed her microwave in there because she couldn't get it working without the clock going. But we got her all fixed up now. He's not a clown. It was so nice. Yeah. Well, that's fifth. You forgot the teenth part. So just Mr. Solomon made himself. What'd you make today? Peanut butter crackers, and he used like a whole whole sleeve of crackers. Yes. A kangaroo has large, powerful back legs and small front leg legs. It also has a long, thick, powerful tail and can fight with its front legs while balanced with its strong tail. Do you remember when we saw those kangaroos fighting on that video? Yeah. A kangaroo can jump about 25 feet and he can go up to 40 miles an hour. Do you want me to help you? No. I'm not looking. Oh, turn it, turn the water off. Thanks. Very good, buddy. Now start at the top. Go down, not up. Okay. There you go. Very good. You are doing such a good job. I did not have to count these ones. You didn't have to count them? Yeah. You just knew what they were? Yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Yep. Okay. Well, that, this is your last page. So write how many, and then we'll fill in your verse. Can I still mix together if I use Not today. So I found an old test of justices that hadn't been scored, and he got a hundred percent. So everybody, give him a hand. No, justice did. And as you all know, I checked everyone's notebooks today, gave a little checkup to everyone, and I'm gonna let the person who had the most perfect notebook Judah. move up, and that was Judah Mills. I was like the same as Judah. Not quite. Judas was the best. All I missed was a few narrations. Yeah. And you didn't have your pages in their own page oh, yeah. protectors oh, yeah. and stuff That's like that. that. So I didn't get any demands, yes, they weren't that bad. But yeah. Judas was definitely the best. Oh, I just popped my finger. Uh, me and I were bad at one of our old bouncy balls <laughs> like three blocks away. Really? Yeah, and it was, we threw it and it was so bouncy. What are they? What are they? Are they planets? No, they are eyes. Oh, they're eyes? Yeah. Did you not finish the craft? But it was a boy, I would have definitely done it. It got like, cut the by name. But this one you have a circle. Does it? Did you make that? Can you make it work? Do you know how to do it? Do it in circles? Is that fun? I don't know how to do it. Do you need a 